good, well meshed together, um, very, very nice as far as uh, meshing it all together, complementing themselves very, very well. Now, I think this was really different from what Polo has released in the past dozen years, I would say. They haven't released anything interesting in the past like 10 years or so. And I really applaud them on this fragrance. This one is a good one from uh, the Ralph Lauren line. A lot of fragrances that are very forgettable from this line. Um, and this one was actually well done. And it's really different from what Ralph Lauren has been uh, releasing in their past. So I applaud them for doing something a little different. And I think it paid off. It was actually, I, I believe this is one of their one of their top sellers actually at the moment. Um, right there with Polo Black, uh, the original of this one. So why would you hate this fragrance? Well, being black ain't easy. A lot of people are going to look at this fragrance and they'll be like, no, you know, the, you know, the, the heavy hitters, the, the people that really have smelt a lot of fragrances, they're going to look at the name, they're going to look at the notes, they're going to smell and they'll be like, ah, eh, this ain't black, it's not dark, I don't like it. Um, they think it's boring also. And longevity problems, which I definitely